What, what, what's going on? We had a couple of challenges this morning. What's your name again, young man? My One student who was out of dress code uh, came here with uh, cut off jeans and his uh, polo shirt as, as a uniform. Um, but students, of course, uh, need to be here in their khakis. The pants that you had on yesterday, you were in dress code. Yeah. They were a little, big, a little big, but you were in dress code. Where are those slacks? Where are those slacks? Yeah. They're dirty. Uh, I'm about to go to the laundromat. I had bought some um, clean and stuff. I left that in, I locked that in. So I'm about to go buy some more. Okay. Go to the line. Now, let me share something with you. Yesterday, you weren't talking like that. Your vocabulary yesterday was much quicker and smoother. Today, it's a little slow. Right. What's going on? I right. ain't going on. Look, I'm, I'm very sleepy. Very tired. Very sleepy and very tired. I didn't go to sleep yet. So what you were doing up all night then? Because I'm just trying to figure out. I'm going to go get him, bro. I'm going to tell him if he's feeling bro. I'm, I'm going to get some more stuff. I could have, I got to go buy some more stuff. So I'm going to try to get some stuff. All right, because I can't, because I can't see you in a class. You know your size? Um, what size are you? Like a 30, 28. A what? 30, 28. Mike, is is this all the clothes you own? Yeah. Everything, yeah, everything for right now. you own is right here. Is that what I'm hearing? Yeah. All right. So this is just dirty clothes. Yeah. Cause I okay. All right. Are you homeless? If you are, we can help you. Yeah, I'm homeless. You are. Yeah. Okay. This is serious. I am just shocked to see how students are supposed to learn. You're supposed to come to a place to learn but you can't learn because your basic needs are not being fulfilled. We have kids who may not have shelter when they get home. That's the, the shocking piece to me. When you leave school today, where do you leave? Go, where do you go? I'm my clothes. You gonna wash your clothes? You gonna laundry, man, wash my clothes right quick. Do you have laundry detergent? But if y'all got some already, that'd be very... Right. We can get some mm -hmm. for you. So this is what we're going to do, ma'am. We have one student that's staying at the Covenant House. Look at me. Now, of course, there's certain rules that you have. But of course, at the end of the day, you have a place to lay your head. I'm, that's I'm much, good at the end that's of the day. That's much better. That's much better than being where you are now. Yeah. And it's much better living from pillow to post, too. You, you're safe. You have, warm, you have a warm house. You got a nice bed, food to eat, right. and it's no worries. No. You can be there for 90 days free. 90 days free. Yes. Some life circumstances that I have not had to wrestle with, approaching 40, some of these students are wrestling with before they're even 20. Let's go take care of your business, and then if you come back, we'll get you in class. Oh, All right. Uh, eat one. All right. And that's why, for me, I, I do believe that's why I'm here. If I can help out, I'll get them to speak and open up. And I think for all of us, the students are seeing that we're actually here for them.